So there is a little bit of confusion on the Martian on the Loose book hunt. So I'm going to clear it all up right now. First of all, what is the Martian on the Loose? How the hell should I know? Then think about it. Me. And the very first thing under this umbrella will be the Expanse book hunt, which has just been launched in North Bay, Ontario. The Expanse book hunt, basically one, James S.A. Corey donated a bunch of books to me to deposit all over the world for fun. Here's how the book hunt works. I have a bunch of books. I write in each book a personal message and at the bottom of my personal message, I give you guys a little sneak peek into season four uh just because i love you and um and i leave these books in secret locations around the world because i'm doing so much traveling and along with these books i put gifts really cool exclusive special gifts for you um then i announce what city the next hunt is going to be on in uh for instance the first one was north bay and then i drop clues now this is where all the, the confusion is happening. The clues come in many forms. The clues are photos that have been digitally altered and then little secrets are given in, in the, you gotta look at the photo really carefully and use the old noggin. It ain't easy and we don't like lazy firehawks, so you gotta work for it. Just pretend it's like a Gollum riddle or something like that or a, or a Harry Potter kind of conundrum that has to be worked out. Um, so it'll be digital photo clues, it'll be videos, it'll be riddles, and it will be sometimes um, audio clues. Um, remember, I've got, I've got months of treasure hunting to do, so I've got all sorts of different kinds of clues coming at you. You've got to work for them. In addition to the basic clues, which are going to tell you the location of the book, you also have to figure out a password, and the password consists of three words. And the, the foundation of this password system is episode seven of season one, for those of you who, who have a good memory, called donkey balls donkey balls and if you recall in episode seven of season one <clears throat> i uh had to find a scroll with three secret passwords on it that i then had to use in a sentence in order to keep myself the rossi crew and the ship from being blown to smithereens by martian military ship that was gonna blow us up so i finally found the scroll ubiquitous mendacious and polyglottal i worked it into a sentence and those guys went away. Ubiquitous and mendacious and polyglottal, like a couple of donkey balls. So in your case, you gotta figure out the three words, work it into a sentence when you get to the location and you get the book. Uh, so how do you figure out this word? Simple. We're putting out these really funny videos that have archetypal sentences from the show. For example, Earth must come third. Anyone who watches the show has heard the Queen herself say, and, and Aaron Wright, Earth must come first. Everyone knows it's Earth must come first. I put out the sentence, Earth must come third. So the word third is wrong, and the correct word is first. So the word first is your first word of your password. The next one. Uh, if you see something that says monkey balls, we all know we don't got any monkey balls in the expanse. So the second password is donkey. And then the third password, let's say I said, here comes the milk. What's the third password? Okay, once you figure out that third password, that's your three. You work it into a sentence. When you go into the location, you tell it to the guy, you get the book. Okay, now that's it. That's how complicated it is. So, those of you who are not local and you want to participate, yes, you can! All you have to do is solve the problem online, use Google Maps and use your brains, figure out the location, figure out the name of the place and the address, figure out the three passwords, email those answers to martianontheloose at gmail.com and you get to win the same gifts that those guys are gonna get in person except they're going to be digital. We're going to email them to you. Now you know. Book hunt, clues, photo clues, video clues, audio clues, riddles, passwords, figure out the three words, use them in a sentence when you go in, and online viewers can play from far away. Email martianontheloose at gmail.com and you will win a prize. Now, 
The final thing is, uh, there's only a certain number of real prizes in each location. Uh, I, I call them gifts, not prizes. And uh, once they're out, that location gets closed down, and then I reveal the location, and that closes that location, and there's no more gifts being given out for that location, and we move on to the next one. So, uh, I got word today, North Bay is out of gifts, so all you North Bay fans, I'm sorry, but North Bay is closed, online uh, submissions are now closed, and uh, we're moving on to the next one, which is Palm Springs. So you're going to be getting all sorts of cool clues and riddles and all sorts of stuff for Palm Springs. The winners of the online stuff will be emailed their digital gifts. Uh, you just have to give my team a little time to kind of do all the logistics on that. It's a, it's a lot of administration stuff. Okay, now I'm ready for questions. So far away, are you coming to the Bay Area? How have, have you read the books? I read one book.